I met Dr. Morris and um, she actually delivered my grandson. So I just loved her at that point. Um, and then I went to her because I was having a lot of uh, bleeding issues and it had gone on for about two years. I thought, oh, you know, it will resolve itself. It did not resolve itself. So when I went in for my annual exam, we talked about it. Actually, in her office, she has the TV where you can um, zero in on different uh, discussions. Mm -hmm. And one of them was um, heavy bleeding or hysterectomy. So I went in there. I, I reviewed that video. She came in, saw that I saw the video, and we talked about it at great length. Um, she was all for the hysterectomy. Um, due to other complications, I, I couldn't do the, the medicine and I couldn't do the ablation. So hysterectomy was the best part for me. Um, it took about a month and a half to get everything put together as far as seeing my general practitioner and pre-surgical stuff. I arrived that morning, uh, probably about 6 o'clock in the morning here at Condell for the surgery and everybody was wonderful. I met everybody who was going to be in the operating room came in to talk to me. Uh, Dr. Morrison came in to talk to me. Uh, went in surgery, woke up, <laughs> couldn't remember anything. Everything went fantastic. Um, and I was actually I was discharged at 4 p.m. that day. So I, I had no overnight stay. It was a little bit of pressure, a little bit of heaviness, but within three days I was just taking Advil. I was able to sleep fine, um, no bleeding, no problems at all, um, no bruising, no stitches. Uh, she did one the puncture right into my belly button. I followed up with her in two weeks. Everything looked fantastic. Within one month, the internal stitches in my belly button were totally healed and gone. Um, and then I followed up with her again at six weeks. And she said, everything's fantastic. I'll see you in a year. And everything has been wonderful since then.